Are you ready for your first trip of the season? Are you excited? Are you going in the camper van? Where are we going? I know, she's taking ages, isn't she? Everything's packed and ready. Why are we still waiting? Why? Why are we still waiting? I don't know. We'll see you when we get there. Bye, Molly. very excited we are on our way for the first trip of 2021 uh, and we have molly down here hopefully you can see her if not she's there definitely there you'll see her later and we are heading from chester to yorkshire i have never been so excited to drive over the m62 <laughs> and uh, yeah very impressed we seem to have packed the van well today because there's very little rattle isn't there yeah so far and um only an hour and a half after our expected uh, <laughs> Hope for departure time. Yeah. It's pretty good going. Been more practice, I think. Yeah, definitely. So uh, yeah, we'll come back to this later when we arrive closer to the campsite. Woohoo! We finally made it to a campsite. Actual campsite. A real campsite. Very excited. We're off to explore. God wait. The vegetarian section and the meat section. Ready, Mo? Did you even chew that? Nope. Steak? Ready, Mole? Ready? <laughs> just embracing a vegetarian side. Yep. Yeah. Vegetarian dog who's just eaten half a steak is now eating a sweet corn. Literally, if he's not nailed down. It's nice, Molly. You finished with this now? Oh, yeah. Right. Yes, thanks. See you. Not bad, folks. Evening stroll. Evening stroll. Oh, well, the trip over yeah. there. Yeah, dog. Yeah. The glamorous trip. It's a bit rubbish. <laughs> Lovely children's play area full of goats, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's got goats in it. <laughs> Two goats, in actual there. goats. But it's a really nice campsite. It's very, very pretty, very quiet and tranquil, and very busy. First weekend away, and we're very, full, very excited about going to the shop tomorrow in the cafe in the farm shop because they've got local produce, burgers, meat, cheese, wine, mm. gin. <laughs> Gin, yes. Local gin. Very excited. Local gin. <laughs> and dog food as well, Molly, haven't they? Local yes. produce. <laughs> Pretend we're here for the dog food. Yeah, dog food. Dog food, not the alcohol. Very excited. Anyway, it's very cold now. We've had a barbecue and we're very cold because it's now the sun's gone in and it's I mean, it's pretty chilly. It's quarter past seven, which really... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. If you ask, if you suggested that to me at home, I'd be like... Yeah. Are you I mad? I decline. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, if you okay. see... Um, well, we'll show you around the other side. The sun's just starting to go Oh, yeah. In the sunshine, it's actually quite warm, but... Oh, yeah, there you go. The sun's just, like, ruined the camera. <laughs> but the sun, yeah, very, very in the shade. It's very cold. So we have to go there. Well, he wants to go over yeah, there. Yeah, you can have a dog. <laughs> <laughs> I think 
think she's having a nice time. What do you think? Yeah. A little tense. She's relaxing. First trip away, yeah. yeah. The goats didn't help. No, <laughs> The people. <laughs> no, totally fine. campsite. <laughs> Not laughing at you, honest. Molly. What are we laughing at? <laughs> Molly is loving life. Having a little roll over there. Shade. After Rolling in the daisy. After eating half the steak. <laughs> That's how we all feel when you can go out. <laughs> First trip out, rolling in the grass. Healthy breakfast today. Ooh, crumpets. Toasted on a rich monkey. Good start. Comfiest place in the van, apparently. She's just chilling out. <laughs> You're waiting to go for a walk, aren't you? <laughs> In a minute, when she's ready. Yeah, when she's ready, we'll go for a walk. Yeah. Okay. Good morning. Hello. Can you not see? No, it's uh, so bright. We're in, so bright. Uh, heading to Pockington, which is where we're staying. We turned out the campsite and went. Right. Yeah, right. And then we're just wandering into Pockington to explore. It was very cold last night, minus one. Freezing. And we forgot to put the heat on, so we got up and turned it on about four o'clock. And then it was nice and warm. Toasty this Toasty, morning, yeah. isn't it? Toasty, yeah. Very nice and warm. So yeah, we've got to explore Pockleton and see what there is to do. And uh, hopefully get something to eat. We've had breakfast, but we're always hungry. So yeah, go and see what else there is to do here in Pocklington, Yorkshire. This is a typical walk, we don't like pavements <laughs> and paths, just find our own way. So we're trying to head to the airfield or the glider club to see a memorial to RAF pilots from the Second World War. So we thought we'd go there and have a picnic from the bakers that we bought because all the pubs were full. The back one. It's so quiet. <laughs> you can see why they use gliders to land at Pegasus, Pegasus Bridge in Normandy. Because there's no way. You didn't even hear that, did we? No, it really crept off. It gave me a fright. Oh my goodness. Is he going to land? The dog just burped. Yeah. <laughs> so it's catching the wind to hold it's itself up to us. land. It's not coming straight at us. Do we run out of the way? When it starts careering across the ground towards us. Wow. wow. That's ace. Don't chase the plane, you weirdo. Golf buggy. That's cool. I've never seen glad this close before. I've never seen them land. Oh look, dips it up on his wing. And then, it's going to fake, it's quite a bit funky. Yeah. It across the floor, it'll knock the wings off. Off buggy, that's so cool. Oops. Run along each side holding a wing each. Yeah, <laughs> it's just as long as he balances it on that side. I think it's alright. Oh, very smooth, is he? Of 
Ross. Okay. <laughs> what cake have you got? Cherry baked quill, my favourite. It's a little bit squashed because of the bag. Oh, sorry about that. I had to carry it. No, just because I was carrying it with a load of other stuff. <laughs> So, it's a lovely sunny day, the sun's just gone in and you're having cake and tea, tea and cake with your outside. cardigan on. <laughs> yeah, my giant fluffy coat. Need it. Oh, we have been out all day, haven't we? Yeah. You're going to have another barbecue now. The horse is right behind you. Is it? It's really distracting. <laughs> oh, yeah. Literally. This is the field at the back of the camper van. It's gorgeous. That's literally the van there. Open the barn doors and you can see the horse straight out the back. It's a lovely sight. So Saturday, first trip after lockdown, and we're having a relax. We've been out exploring this morning. Cheers. Cheers. Here's to some great more adventures on our travels in Kempfen. We've been very, what's the word? Educated. Well, I, I, I wouldn't say that. Oh, yeah. I'm looking <laughs> for where else to go next. So we've really enjoyed it here. It's a very nice size, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. It's, it's, um quite peaceful. Yeah, it's quiet. Yeah. It? It's only like less than a mile into Pocklington, which was really, really enjoyed Pocklington. Yeah, we enjoyed that yeah. today. Nice town, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. It's really bright. It's really, sorry. A lot of independent, um, yeah, it's squinting back. Yeah, there. shops. A lot of independent stores, which we've not really seen. Yeah. For a while. But we've not really seen shops for a while. No. <laughs> to be fair. No shops. Nothing. So it's been um, really nice. And we decided, because we had a barbecue last night when we got here. Mm -hmm. Um, we had lots of barbecue food and alcohol, and then we decided that we would have another one today. So we've been to the butchers in the village and bought I bought some steak and some more vegetarian food. Caroline's vegetarian. The co-op. I'm not. <laughs> Good old co-op. Neither is Molly. <laughs> and we've been to Delicatessen, that nice shop we went to. Oh yeah, cheers. Which we showed before, yeah, that was really nice. Really nice shop, really friendly as well. Everyone's really friendly, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, Yorkshire, people I think are always people friendly. people are just as excited to see people back in their shops as well, aren't they? <laughs> Yes, yeah. come in, spend some money. So you can probably see it behind, but we're about to have another barbecue in a minute. And then um, we'll have a nice evening. Oh yeah, it's relaxing. a nice place to spend an afternoon, yeah. isn't there? But it's you really good. used to this. Because the, yeah, the van's been perfect. The first trip out this season, everything's worked. Touch wood. No issues. That's my prep. See? <laughs> I'm yes. a master now. Prepped it fine. Yeah. That's my... I like it was freezing last night. It was, it was minus, so minus yeah, it was one. Really cool. Um, and I didn't turn the heating on or leave it on like low or anything so yeah. I turned it on about four o'clock and then it was really nice and toasty and warm so we slept in a bit this morning didn't we? more yeah. than normal yeah I think once and the heating was on we slept much better but when you wake up in the night it's so cold and the bedding feels wet I know I let Molly out about four five just in case she wanted to go out we wanted to lie in so yeah that was it really yeah Molly's adapting to camping life as well yeah. She's like she, on high alert. She's quite highly strung as collies often are. So anybody that walks past, she's like, oh, must bark at them. The horse keeps walking past. She's yeah. like on, she's like on she pins. likes the horse though, she's quite rare. Yeah. She doesn't like horses normally. There's a, there's a good shop here. We've got loads of um, pet food and we've bought like a, a chewy on the side, hide. A shop on the side, campsite. Yeah, a chewy hide. <laughs> um, we just mm. kept her quiet for about two hours. So. It's um, worth 90p. Is that what it was? Yeah. It's really good, isn't it? I know. I want to go back and buy it. <laughs> a box full. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the campsite, the, the owners or the managers are really friendly, aren't they? Yeah. And they arrive, really nice. Yeah. Uh, made you feel really welcome. And then uh, say hello every time you see them and everyone, uh, really nice site, really well kept and good facilities. We've managed to park in and we've got a hard standing pitch. You need to get a hard standing pitch. I think the one's With, in the middle. Of, yeah. Quite close together. Electric. But a lot um, of people seem to be in, in, like in, groups, in family yeah. groups, so within six seats then. And there's a tap as well, it's just a, just a, the other side of the van, so we can just fill up with water as well. If we run out, hopefully we'll fill up once we won't need to. But you never know. Yeah. <laughs> she likes water. Like I use There's nothing wrong with being clean. <laughs> so yeah, we've had a very, very pleasant first trip out and uh, yeah. looking forward to many more 
So, yeah, in the highlights yeah, today, we can plan our summer road yeah, trip, aren't we? The rest of Scotland. You can hear a plane in the sky there. We went to the uh, airfield before, or the glider club by mistake. We found it by mistake. We turned around and then a glider landed right behind us, which hopefully you've seen or you will see in the video. It was really cool, wasn't it? Yeah. It was a highlight of my day. Just heard this thud and then there's the plane. Yeah. Behind so, us. Yeah. Yeah, we'll yeah. But dogs weren't allowed on the airport. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we were just uh, enjoying ourselves and relaxing, having a drink and a barbecue and uh, getting back into the the, the whole <laughs> travelling around in your van, visiting places, meeting stuff. I am very excited for this steak. It looks very nice indeed from the local butchers in Pocklington. So I'm gonna let it rest before cooking it and then see what it tastes like. Some wife has decided to buy me a beer from the little shop on the campsite. Yorkshire beer, tether blonde. So let's see what it tastes like. Hmm, actually that's rather good. English Pale Ale brewed with three distinctive American hops for a citrus fruity flavour and dry finish. Very good. Okay, steak from the butchers. Let's try this steak. I'll see, it looks stunning. Uh, olive oil, salt and pepper. Let's see what it tastes like. Oh, massive. Oh, didn't pick it up. Oh my goodness. I'll put this down. All right, here we go. The grill's nice and hot. It's absolutely ginormous. Yep, thanks Molly, I don't need your help. That is huge. I'm a vegetarian steak. Local produce. Okay, I'm so excited. I got a pork pie from Bocklington. These are the finest pork pies in the area, apparently. Lovely crust, as you can see. I'm going to cut into the pie. Okay, the pork pie filling to pastry to jelly ratio is perfect. This looks one heck of a good pot pie. But, <clears throat> this is a ridge monkey and this is why bacon medallions sizzling away. No mess, close the lid, keeps everything in, contained, nice and easy to clean up. Uh, apart from that, the smell out, which is the best bit. It's a cool place, isn't it? It's really cool. Yeah, We're just taking Molly out for a morning walk and to get a coffee, which we don't normally do, but we thought we would today. Yeah, it's sunny, yeah. So we're just having a wander yeah. around Pocklington. We went back in to walk the dog because it's a really, really nice little town, village. Yeah, the shops, village. some of the shops are open. The uh, bakers is open, which is nice. And uh, yeah, here we are at Arkwright. <laughs> and there's cute little shops, very much a mix of independence and traditional shops. And there's a art centre and a cinema. We didn't go in there, um, but really cool, nice, nice place. It's got lots of, uh, say, some chain shops and some independent shops, and a good mixture, and lots of places to get nice foods and, and eat as well. But all the pubs, even this morning, we've seen all the pubs are open, serving breakfast, and the cafes are already full. And, you know, it's like half nine in the morning. Um, but yeah, it's a lot of mixture of traditional and modern. Very nice indeed. Highly recommended. And that's it, we're off. We're leaving the campsite after a lovely weekend in the sunshine in Yorkshire. The sun is still shining, so a nice, hopefully, deep guy. Christmas tree. Oh yeah, Christmas tree. I think that's all plugged into the campsite on the ground. Yeah, very nice site. Small, perfectly sized, good space pitches, nice firm ground, 
good facilities that we could use. The other toilets and stuff are locked because obviously of COVID. Uh, but yeah, really nice site, nice little shop and perfect for exploring Pocklington and surrounding areas. So yeah, I would definitely recommend I would return. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.